Hey guys, welcome back. I uh, just thought I'd uh, show some recent back issue acquisitions I picked up. Uh, just a little bit of everything. Uh, I got some uh, Green Lantern. Uh, these are some issues that I used to have. Uh, and, uh, well, I won't go through what happened to them and how I lost them, but uh, needless to say, I just kind of wanted them back. Uh, just some stuff like, I guess, late 70s, early 80s. Uh, but this is uh, Green Lantern 127, and this is actually the first uh, DC cover work by Brian Bolland. So, pretty nice cover. You can see Bolland's signature. And another run that I was going to try to get, uh, I think with this issue, uh, it started like some uh, Adam Strange backups and uh, Green Lantern core. And uh, I was loved Adam Strange, one of my favorite characters. And uh, so I just wanted to pick all these up again. And these were, uh, you know, you can find these on the cheap. So it's pretty cool. But this is a re another really nice cover by uh, George Perez and uh, Dick, Dick Giordano. Okay, and then we have a Silver Age. <coughs> this is one that I've wanted for a while. Uh, and uh, it's not like in mint condition or anything. It's probably like a good plus. VG minus, but I always love this cover. I remember reading the uh, reprint of this, like in a DC special or something like that. But this is number 32, the Power Battery Peril. I just thought that was a cool cover. And we've got some Charlton comics. Uh, this is a run that I'm trying to complete. I think I'm maybe two or three away. Uh, Doomsday plus one. This is number three. Some early John Byrne work. Pretty decent copy. And we've got some Secret Origins number seven. This is the last issue in the run, and actually the last one that I needed uh, to complete this one. Uh, so this was on the list to uh, have a video done. The Origin of Robin and Aquaman. These are all like. Uh, Golden and Silver Age reprints. So, this is pretty cool stuff. It's a pretty nice copy. And this one here, <clears throat> I've been looking for a deal on it for a while. And uh, this is a Super DC Giant number S17. Uh, Love, 1970. Great Nick Carty cover. I just love this cover. When I first saw it, I thought it was Neil Adams. I'm like, well, that's not Adams, but that's uh, that's some really nice artwork by Nick Carty. And just got some uh, your basic romance reprints. But this one, and I think number S22 are like the toughest ones to like find in any kind of grade or find a deal on. Uh, and this one's probably like a I don't know, like a good plus also. It's got a uh, it's got a little chip out of the top of the corner. And will crease. Otherwise, it's uh, pretty decent. So, I'm trying to complete my Super DC Giant run. Uh, this is a book <clears throat> I had uh, back in the 80s, and I wanted to have it again. Like, say, long story on how I lost some of that other stuff I had. But uh, first, Prince of Black Mask <clears throat> got a pretty nice deal on this, and uh, this is a book. I think it's probably on the uptick just because of. Uh, the appearance in the Harley Quinn Birds of Prey movie, which I just watched that movie recently just to say that I did, and it was uh, pretty terrible. <laughs> just my opinion. Uh, but yeah, it's first appearance of Black Mask. I think this has got some Tom Mandrake art in it. This is probably like a fine copy. Okay, and uh, this is another run that I've been uh, trying to complete, and I just recently uh, completed it. So these last uh, four issues are the only ones I needed to complete the Phantom Stranger run. This is number two. Number six. Great Neil Adams cover. I think he did the interior art on uh, a couple of them. Maybe number four or number five. But he did some great covers. So that's number six. Eight. 
I think uh, around six or seven, I think uh, Jim Apparel started doing the interiors and uh, had some really awesome artwork in it. Great cover. And last but not least, number 10. I really love this cover. More Neil Adams goodness. It's got a little color loss there, but uh, you know, I got a pretty good deal on it. I just wanted to have it. I might get upgrade this one later on. But that's all I got for today, guys. Uh, hope you enjoyed this. Hope you're having a great weekend. Uh, hope you enjoy the holiday tomorrow. And uh, I'll see you soon. Onward and upward.